What's up? My name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and today I've got a bit of a different video for you. Google Play Music is disappearing in December 2020, and you can use their built-in transfer to YouTube option to sync all of your playlists and the rest with YouTube Music. Or you can do that and take your saved playlists and the rest to other platforms. That's what I'm doing. I've already moved all of my playlists and songs to my Spotify account. Tutorial linked in the description below. Today, I'll be moving all of my data across to my Tidal account, another streaming platform. I've been using the free trial recently and it's been rather enjoyable. Yes, I already showcased the website we'll be using here in another video and it's simple enough to copy across to other platforms. But I thought it was important to revisit this and do another video on this topic as I received an official email from Tidal themselves advertising this website service to me, as seen on screen. So let's just begin the process. Head across to TuneMyMusic.com. Then click Let's Start. Select the platform you're moving from, so in my case, Google Play Music. This will be different for all of the different platforms, but for Google Play Music, what we do is we drag this Convert Playlist bookmark to our bookmark bar at the very top. Don't see it? Use Control shift b to show or hide that bar. Then head across to Google Play Music and then the playlist you want to copy across. Then simply click the bookmark and the page will start scrolling down, adding songs to the list on their website. When it reaches the bottom, the web page reopens with a list of songs visible. Clicking next, we choose a platform we're moving to. So I'll select Tidal, sign in with my Tidal account, then click Start Moving My Music. The more songs you have, the longer this process will take. After it's done, you can click the Show Only Missing Tracks checkbox to toggle between successfully moved songs and songs that couldn't be found on the target platform. Clicking the download button next to the checkbox downloads a small file containing the list of missing songs. Heading across to Tidal, Playlists, and clicking on one of the playlists that I just moved across, you can see a description automatically added by the platform and all of my favorite songs, minus those it couldn't find. It's that simple. Rinse and repeat for the rest of your playlists, and you're completely moved across from one platform to another. It's pretty much the same moving across to or from basically any other platform that they support. Again, I thought it was a bit important to revisit this topic as quite a few people have asked whether it was legitimate or not. Having an email come from Tidal themselves seems to prove its validity quite a bit. Anyways, that's about it for this video. Thank you for watching. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.